Hey guys, welcome back to Easton and George. I mean, Easton Tech Reviews. Today, I am going to show you how to use the PairPC Virtual Box GUI. Okay. So you need to download that file to, in my website. I'll give you a link in the description below. Hmm. You're here, read more. You have to download this file. Yeah, you have to unarchive it with your or an archiver. And it's compressed in 7-zip and stuff it. So, <clears throat> this is for Windows and Mac. This is actually meant for Windows. But, yeah. You have to <coughs> download a wine bottler to run the exe file. Well, I already got my original copy and wine bottler, I'll also give you a link. Here we go, this website. You can then download that one or that one. There's actually other apps that they have. Kromberg. Okay, so run this exe file with wine. It should work. Yes, here we go. Let's minimize that. So, it does have a pair PC file for its config. And I suggest you make a folder called pair PC, like mine, to store all your pair PC files in. I have, a, I have just two. By the way, I will provide the images to find them by yourself but I think in the future I'll upload them if I have time but that will make the fans spin crazy it's like a virtual box but just click new hey the cheetah is supposed to be 10.0 they list it wrong Ha 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 ha! Well, they meant 10.2, and they have their wrong name, so I selected that one. And it's a Jaguar. But they think it's a cheetah. You can browse it. Look in the pure PC folder. If you have Wine Bottler, it will go users, eSong, users, your username wine files drive c users blah 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 it will go like this go into your pair pc folder and you select your img file if you have iso select it here but that one already has the operating system installed plus that one is um customized <coughs> start this one. Oh, here we go. This is already customized with mine. So I have two accounts, one for my little brother and one for me. Because maybe he wants to play with RAM with that. Okay. Somebody's catching me. My oh wait, what the Hey it's no internet, by the way. This Jaguar or Jaguar. Most people call it Jaguar. And to exit, you just don't press Command. To use the Command tab, log into mine. Here we go. Log. Logging in. Here we go. Let's go take a look. About this Mac. Yeah, 10.2. So, G3? What? Okay. 
impossible. Okay. But 512 megs of RAM, that's kind of nice. Shut down. Shut down. There's actually different icons. Yep. Let's have a new one. This time it's going to be Tiger. Hmm, Tiger. Tiger. Tiger 10.4. Okay, now you need to browse your HDD. It works until Tiger. Open. Next. You can leave it blank if you already have the OS installed. Tiger 10.4. Let's start this. One be this almost the same. The version's different. This, this is exactly like Virtual Boss. If you're if you already know Virtual Boss, you can just go to my website and download them. But whoa! And my fan spinning. Oh no! Oh no! Oh. Oh no! Oh. God damn it. Now this thing crashed. Okay. okay. You know what I do? I shut down this one. Hey, let's force grip. This one. Nice. Done. Thank you guys for watching. Comment, like, and subscribe. See you like next time. Bye. No covering camera, by the way. I'll just stop the audio.